Hey guys, my name is Tim Schmoyer and I'm a lifeguard apparently today. This Thursday, time to do some YouTube Q&A for you guys. We'll take a question that one of you asks, do my best to answer it. This week's question comes from Kids312 who wrote and asked this. Tim, should we use advertising on YouTube to gauge subscribers on first days of a new channel? Because I'm doing optimizing videos, everything as you recommended, but it's going very slow. Do you recommend advertising videos on YouTube to gain more subscribers? That's a good question. If you are just getting started on YouTube, no, I do not recommend that you go and put paid promotion behind your, your videos and your channel in general. And the reason for that is because when you are first getting started, like everyone who's starting thinks that their content is awesome and that the only problem that they have is lack of exposure. And if they just got exposure, that their channel would blow up and they would be doing great. The only problem with that though is that I have actually never seen that be the case. Now, if you've been doing videos for like a year or two, maybe even six months, go back and look at some of your very first videos. Do you think that they're as awesome now as you thought they were then? Like, I sure don't. I'll put a link in the description below this video to my very first YouTube video ever from March of 2006. And although at the time I thought it was a, you know, a half decent video, now I look at it, I'm like, oh man, that's so painful. So every creator that's starting out has a lot to learn about themselves, about their voice, about their personality on camera, how do they talk to their audience, who their audience actually becomes and is. You just need a lot of time to learn a lot of those lessons and you actually have like this gift when you, your channel is smaller and that you can experiment with like a lot of different things. You can try a lot of different new ideas. You can see what really works well and what sticks and what doesn't stick as opposed to like, you know, just getting started out and all of a sudden, let's say you got a million subscribers in your first week, okay? Let's just say that happens. And now you're kind of stuck because they all subscribe for like this one style or this thing, but maybe three or four months from now, you know, you're still kind of new at this. You realize like, I don't really want to do that anymore. Well, now you're gonna alienate and lose a lot of people. So take advantage of the time while your channel is small. Now, if you do wanna put paid promotion behind your channel, I recommend only doing that behind videos and content that have already proven that they will convert well for you. Putting money to promote videos that already aren't working won't suddenly make them start working, you know? But if you have videos that are working, that are taking non-subscribed viewers and successfully converting them into subscribers, and you see that they become commenters and they start becoming an active part of your channel, then at that point, yeah, some of those videos might be worth promoting. Otherwise, you're really just wasting your money. Now, I have an ebook that might be helpful for a lot of you guys who do want to optimize your channel to successfully convert non-subscribed viewers into subscribers, and then how to convert those subscribers into an active and engaged part of your community. That book is called 30 Days to a Better YouTube Channel. So if you wanna take a shortcut and save yourself a lot of time from figuring out a lot of the lessons and the things you gotta work through in the beginning, like I said, like this book will take you a, like a straight cut, short, bleh, can't talk. A shortcut straight there. So that book is down there below. Also, you'll find another link down there that'll go to our sponsor here at Video Creators, famebit.com, and you can find other YouTube creators to collaborate with there. If you wanna start growing your exposure and start mixing audiences with other people and having them promote you and you promote them and just kind of cross-pollinating that way, that can be an awesome way to start building your exposure on YouTube and start getting an audience that won't cost you anything. And while you're on FameBit's site, you can also find brand deals there of companies who want to pay you to talk about their products and their services inside your videos. You do need a minimum of 1,000 subscribers to sign up. So if that's you, check out the link in the description below and start landing brand deals to earn more money through your channel and also start growing your channel's audience through collaborations. I have two questions for you guys. One, how would you answer this question for this person? I have paid to promote you know, my YouTube, my family's vlogging YouTube channel before. And what I learned through that experience, just you know, condense it all down for you guys into a nutshell, is that only 1% of the views I paid for converted into a subscriber that actually ended up watching more of our videos down the road. You, you get more subscribers, but it's really hard to turn those paid viewers into like, in my example anyway, it was hard to take those paid viewers and convert them into active and engaged subscribers that actually became part of your community going forward. So I have done paid campaigns on other YouTube channels to build exposure for something, but if there's a budget for growing an audience and building subscribers, I think that it's better invested 
spent in like flying to someone's, you know, house and doing a collaboration, you know, or with some other, you know, meeting up with it, like put that money into travel and actually collaborate with someone that could really work well for your channel and for their channel. So number one, I really want to hear how you would answer this question. But two, if you have done pay promotion to build subscribers on your channel, what's worked best for you? Give us some tips and ideas, you know, down there below. I'm really looking forward to learning from you guys. I know you will have a lot of great advice. So share all that stuff down there. And if this is your first time here at Video Creators, I would love to have you subscribe every Thursday. Do some YouTube Q&A just like this, help you guys out with some questions about your channels. On Tuesdays, we take a look at some of the online video news and the updates happening here on YouTube and the online video industry as a whole. On Wednesdays, I give you guys some YouTube tips, advice, ideas, things like that. And I do all of this because I really believe that a lot of you guys have messages that need to spread, that the world really does need to hear. And I want to do everything I can to help you guys grow your YouTube channels and your audiences so that the people who need to hear what you have to say can simply find you and hear what you have to say. So thank you for letting me be a part of that. Subscribe here and I'll see you guys again next week. Bye.